Well, this has been a very epic weekend and just one where all the plans had all come together. So a couple of weeks ago, Jay and I passed up a pretty nice stag on this property that I was hunting with two things in mind for passing it up. The first was letting the stag get a bit older, potentially a bit bigger. And the second was leaving it for someone else to shoot that might not have shot a stag that good before. So fast forward to just a couple of days ago, I'd reorganized the property, uh, contacted my buddy Chris and was like, hey man, I'm heading out in this property. I know there's a ruddy stag lingering around if you want to come try and hunt it. So happily got up super early and met me up on the farm. We got out there and the morning time, we seen quite a few deer, but just nothing nothing with bone on its head and yeah the afternoons when things started to kick off yeah as you'll see i'll chuck in a bit of footage from a couple of weeks ago with jay but it, he got the same stag that we'd passed up so that just makes it even more epic so enjoy the video guys cheers we have got a cracker morning today I'll go see if we can find some deer We're seeing plenty of deer, but nothing with bone on its head, so just gonna make our way up the top of this ridge and have a glass into this next gully, see if we can find anything. Where are the deer? <laughs> Wallabies. Yeah, do they count? Uh, no. <laughs> Not unless they've got antlers. Would have been on two then. <laughs> wallabies with antlers could be in trouble. Invasive wallabies with antlers. Foxes, you get foxes with antlers. <laughs> <laughs> Chris and I are back out for an Arvo hunt. Did no good this morning. We've seen quite a few deer. I think we saw like 11 deer all up, but yeah, no stag. So back out again the Arvo and we'll see how we go. He's about to preach. He's preaching. Yep. Yeah. Would he be your best stag? Smoke him if you want, man. Oh, good. Yeah, he's... Stop now, but mm -hmm. there'll be plenty of shots when he further goes left. Yeah, I've lost him now. <laughs> he's going to the scrub, scrub. Yeah, if, if he comes out and you want to shoot him, just shoot him, man. I don't care. He sounds, might, I actually think... It sounds, I'm tempted not to, be honest. No, it's up to you, man. I think he's the, the he might be the smaller one, Jay and I seen. He yeah, and I, and I don't have any intentions of putting him on a wall as well. Thrashing, yep, clear. Yeah, I'm good. So, okay. so those two trees. Alright, let's see how we go. Yeah, I can zoom. Okay, alright, shoot when ready. Can I zoom in? Yep, just load around real quick, he's about to move. Yep, good to go. Yep. Quick. Yep, you hit me. 
That felt good, dude. Yeah, you're definitely eating. That felt very good. Whew. That felt very good. That felt good. <laughs> that was a solid thump. Holy f He's a good stag, man. I didn't have that one, I was like, I'm not too sure, I think I'll let him grow. Yeah. As soon as you turn his head, and you can see the difference between the white tip and the in the face of his head. They want no thing <laughs> We're in for a big night now. Oh, fuck. Let's hope he's not too hard to find. Otherwise, it's going to be a morning job. Yeah, there was no time for the earplugs. No. There was no time. <laughs> that felt good, man. Well, pretty sure Chris has just made a very good shot on that nice stag. We'd seen another little stag earlier, which we got a little bit of footage of preaching, and Chris just wasn't feeling it and made the right call of passing him up. And yeah, we're actually just about to walk out of this spot and go to another spot before last light. And yeah, this stag's on his face, so bloody happy day. So he's gonna drop down in here and hopefully the dogs will find him pretty quick. He's, he's run straight down the gully, which the gully opens up in this little paddock here. So, should be able to find him pretty quick, hopefully. Bloody beautiful. Hurry up. <laughs> Good dog, Ram. Good girl. Oh, dude. <laughs> oh, dude. Holy shit. Man, that, look at the coronets on that thing. Oh. He's so much big, bigger in the, the ground. <laughs> I knew he was good, but fuck. Rem, you get back steps tonight, girl. Holy f He's He's just been rubbing as well. Yeah. Dude, thank you so much, man. Holy <laughs> shit. Dude. That is epic, bro. He is way bigger than I thought. How good he's left. And look at his right, he's got that little kink on it, on his top. Look at the base on it. That is unreal. Still got the stringy bark on him. Man, that is epic. Dude. I'm so stoked for it. <laughs> Couple of hard days of hunting, get it done. Getting up here was shit. <laughs> yeah, I didn't even video it because it was too messed Oh, up. man. Dude. <laughs> Absolute cracker, man. Gonna just snap that bit of twig in front of you. Yeah. <laughs> nice, big, mature stag. Big rats. Look at the mass on him, too. Nice. Thick the whole way. <laughs> oh, Mid brows. Dude. Oh my god. Where are you, Rem? <laughs> Remy. Digging a hole. <laughs> Where are you? Are you ready gone back to sleep? <laughs> She's done her job. <laughs> oh my god. I'm stoked for you, bro. Man, thank you so much. I'm so glad I passed up that first one. Me too. Just said let him grow. Man, he's got a heap of hook to him. Dude, that he, like, he'd, be, he'd be at least 28 for sure. You big son bitch, huh? He even got his little. He's stick. got his glands, yeah. He's been having a good old afternoon. Oh, oh my what God. a beast! This is so much better than I imagined. <laughs> All the hard work, bro. The amount of times I've been like on the treadmill and shit, thinking oh, I'll walk up on one of these one day. And it's happened. It happened. <laughs> oh, I can't get over it, mate. <laughs> He is a beast. You are going to be well remembered for the rest of your life, brother. He doesn't look actually, he's in good neck as well. Yeah, man. Now that's a ruddy neck, isn't yeah. it? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah dude. Big, big on him. Oh my God. Thank you, Rem. That would have been a morning job for sure. Oh, without the dogs, yeah. Without Rem. <laughs> <laughs> she found him pretty quick. I man, said, I... no shit down there, I seen her lift her nose and I was like, Rem can smell something. And then straight up she went, and I was like, oh. So cool. was that better to come in low? Did you do that deliberately? So her, like the, obviously the down No, well, so that's what I was worried about, at elevation. Like, I wasn't 100% sure whether he was above or below us. He was a lot lower than I thought, to be honest. I thought we were like 50 metres too low. Well, we just gained probably 20 metres to get up to Ram, so we were close. No, tw 20 metres ago, I was like, oh, we can leave it for the morning, man. <laughs> oh, my God. Man. Alright, I'm going to turn this camera off and I'm going to get... Oh, is that rolling the whole time? Yeah, the whole time it's been rolling.
Well, here he is, guys. Chris has done a bloody cracker job getting his first good stag. Thank yeah, you, that's mate. That's that was what an afternoon. <laughs> it was unreal. Passed up a little one that was preaching, got a good bit of footage of that. And yeah, we were on our way out to a different part of the property and seeing this guy feeding on the other face. And he's, as you can see, he's got fresh rub marks and that nice ruddy stag. He's got an awesome cape. So we're about to cape him out now. It's going to be a bit of a late night and I've got work in the morning, so that's going to be fun. <laughs> <laughs> Chris has got another day off, lucky bastard. But yeah, we'll get to work. <laughs> a ruddy stag here. I don't know how they get through the bush. <laughs> oh, quarter of the way, perfect. <laughs> 